This is my exact cutting routine right now, you fat fucking cunt. And the reasons why I'm not cutting on OMAD. Let's begin. My exact routine right now. I eat approximately 2,000 calories per day. 2,000 per day. It changes depending on how much activity I'm doing. I'm eating 400 calories maximum in a fucking meal. A snack. 400 max. Okay, I'll have anywhere from four of those snacks to six of those snacks some days, which would be 1,600 calories to 2,400 calories. Okay, obviously the 2,400 calorie day is going to be a day where I did a fucking shitload of activity. 1,600 is going to be a lower day. Some days, if it's a complete rest day, I might only have two of those snacks or even one or even none. Okay, two snacks would be about 800 cal. One snack would be 400 cal. That day, I'd probably push that snack to the tail end of the day. Just didn't do nothing that day. I had a rest. Obviously, no snacks. I'd be fucking fasting on snake juice and not eating nothing that day. Simple. Now, as far as when I put the meals into my day, sometimes I'll eat one meal that's super low carb to start the day off, train after that meal, then stack maybe three more meals after that. It's always just low carb. I'm in ketosis most of the day, okay? Sometimes it might be two meals before the gym, two meals after. On an extreme day where I'm burning way more calories, maybe it's three meals before the gym, three meals after. Okay, I still try to keep the food as far from bedtime as possible unless it's a day where I just did crazy activity. I got no choice but to eat another snack later. It's just a snack. It's super low carb. My sugar and insulin response from these snacks is fuck all. I don't fucking give a fuck about any of that shit because now I'm going to get into the point why I'm doing this instead of OMAD. Because on this routine, I can eat less fucking food, less calories, more fucking energy, and I'm never fucking hungry. It just comes down to that. It's fucking not rocket science. I can eat less, so I'll lose more weight there. I have more energy, so I have more caloric output. I'll lose more weight because of that. And I fucking, I'm never hungry. I'm never fucking hungry. So on a sheer performance level, this fucking kicks the shit out of fucking OMAD. Okay, OMAD's an old lady's diet. Truth be told, that's one of the old problems with one meal a day. Most people are lazy as fuck and they don't count calories. It's a calorie game, you idiot. It's a fucking calorie game. Fuck. Regardless, my performance is dog shit on OMAD compared to this at a fucking calorie count that's equal or less. It's that simple and I'm never hungry doing this. This is the better cutting routine, hands down. Doesn't even fucking compare. OMAD's an old lady's diet. Okay, if you're actually strict on counting your calories, the fucking meal should be small on OMAD, and therefore your performance during the day as a whole is gonna be shit compared to mine. Shit. You're never gonna be able to put out the volume. Not even fucking close. Not even close. Okay, I'm cutting right now. I wanna keep my strength as high as possible. As high as fucking possible. I want to be able to log a crazy amount of cardio. Okay, because I still swim, I bike, I do all this shit. Okay, I'm not just going to do a 72 hour fucking fast to cut this fucking weight. Okay, the long fast for the fat pigs. Okay, the fat pigs. Okay, people forget that I cater to fucking people that are 600 pounds all the way down to people that have like two fucking pounds to lose before they're fucking ripped single digit body fat. Which one are you? Which one are you? Okay, I'm not going to do a seven day fucking fast right now. Why the fuck would I do that? Or even a three day fast. What am I going to do? Just sit around all day and fast? I'm not going to quit training so I can sit around and do a longer fucking fast to speed up fucking weight loss. I don't give a fuck about that. Okay, it's the consistency. I want to make gains. I actually want to make strength gains on this cut. Okay, fat asses is a whole different fucking story. It's a whole different fucking story. Now, lastly, as far as OMAD goes, my goal is to fucking be lean all day long. Okay, I don't want to fucking be lean for part of the day and have a big protruding fucking gut and be bloated the fuck up. I'm not even talking about the fucking OMAD addiction and chasing that one big meal for that big dopamine hit. I'm just talking about being lean all day. Okay, all day. Okay, I have more usable time in the day to do shit. Okay, this is faster for me to do this like these fucking snacks take me a minute i don't even have to go to the store i can just scrounge up something okay it doesn't have to be this big fucking production 
I can eat less calories, have more fucking energy, and have less hunger. It's, that's it. Those three things. That's the answer. That's why I fun quit OMAT. That is it right there. Did I quit doing long fasts? No. I'll still skip a full day once in a while. But am I doing any real long fasts? Like fucking three, four, five, six, seven days? Fuck no. There's no reason for me to do those long fucking fasts. That's fat people shit. Fuck. That's for fat asses. You know how many people are coming at me right now fucking getting pissed off that I'm fucking knocking OMAD? And these people are like, oh, I'm fucking 17% now, down from 30% body fat. Yeah, good. But you're not 8%, you fucking moron. Fuck, 12%? Are you fucking serious? 12% I can maintain that in my fucking sleep. Okay, it's a joke. You're not even lean. Like, shut the fuck up until you actually get stripped. Okay, and then tell me what works. Okay, then tell me what works when you're trying to have a high volume lifestyle activity wise and you're trying to get stripped. Then tell me what the fuck works, idiot. Then tell me how great your fucking one meal a day diet is at night when you're trying to fucking swim a mile at 10 a.m. Then tell me how fucking great it is. Tell me how great it is if you take a fucking bicycle at fucking 3 p.m. and you still haven't ate yet because you're doing old mad at night and you're going to bike up a fucking ski hill. Tell me how great it is then when you make it fucking a tenth of the way up. Like, shut the fuck up. There's something for everybody. There's something for everybody. But OMAD, even strict OMAD, that's an old lady's diet. It's an old lady's diet that don't do shit. That's for fucking people that are just fucking lazy and don't do shit. Okay, fine. Fine, you don't want to do any activity, fucking sit in your fucking ass all day and eat a strict OMAD diet. Strict meaning you're counting the calories and actually seeing weight loss. If you're not losing weight, change it, idiot. Okay, most people are not counting the calories on OMAD. That's the whole fucking problem. Okay, that's my routine. Basically, four to six, 400 calorie meals a day. Some days I'll go as low as fucking one, two, or none. Okay, none would be a day where I skip a new fast. Now, as far as my training routine goes, fuck, I haven't lifted a weight in months. Ever since flu season, when all the fucking gyms were closed, I started just doing all the training outside in the calisthenics. I have hardly touched a weight at all. Fuck, I don't even lift weights anymore. I do fucking push-ups, pull-ups, fucking calisthenics, static holds, fuck around on bars, fucking lunges, fucking body squats. Okay, I hardly lift any weights at all. Okay, I do bear crawls, I bike, I fucking still skip, swim. That's my lifestyle, fuck. Okay, so people keep asking me, what about my weights and shit? I don't even lift fucking weights no more. Fuck, I used to power lift. I've been power lifted since 2018. Okay, I was still real strong in the fucking weights up till two years ago, but because of this fucking flu bullshit, I fucking just basically gave it up because I fucking felt healthier training out in the fucking park. I felt healthier doing calisthenics. Okay, so I gave up beating the shit out of my body doing all these fucking compound heavy ass movements. It's simple. Okay, it's each to their own. Go do whatever the fuck you want. Get in shape, get ripped, bitch. I don't give a fuck what you do. Do whatever you want for exercise. Just fucking get in shape and have a decent amount of muscle on your body. Fuck. Simple. That's my cutting routine right now. Basic as fuck. Count the calories. Weigh yourself every day. I eat small fucking meals under 400 calories a pop. I don't chase big fucking meals. I do body weight training and that's it. And then I just throw in a little bit of fasting. Skip a day sometimes on a rest day with no food or a very little food on those rest days. That's it. Until next time, stop fucking eating, fatty!